There's no way you'd get the VFR up that hill. Uh, I don't care who you are. Even Knievel himself couldn't get up that hill. Dale Buggins wouldn't get up that hill. Actually, maybe he would. Anyway, I certainly wouldn't have gotten up there on that bike. And on the um, on the trusty Himalayan, it was like a the thing's like a bloody mountain goat. It just flies up the hills like you can't imagine. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna definitely in a bit of trouble.
I might have a slight problem with this gear lever. It's um, a bit bent. Uh, yeah, it's very bent, in fact. That might be a bit harder to change gears on. I'm just going to have to come off to get fixed properly. That'll do for now. They should have called it the mountain goat. It's off-road. This thing keeps surprising me with its uh, ability. It's just it, it it flatters the lazy and incompetent rider like myself. There's a nice breeze coming across here now, actually, which is helping to wick away the sweat from my somewhat rotund body. Um, all the accessories are good. Oh, one thing I will say about the infield, the ground clearance is not fantastic. Um, it's not terrible, but it's not an enduro bike. Despite the fact that it will start to take you places an enduro bike will take you, it is not an enduro bike. And it reminds you of that when you try to jump over logs and things. Crush nuts can be the order of the day, so be a little bit careful there. But um, it hasn't, um, there's no vital fluids leaking out, so that's good. Other than that, this thing just keeps on impressing me. So I, I don't have too many other whinges about it. I, I will have some whinges. Um, I just can't think what they are at the moment because at the moment I'm so happy with the way it's been going out here in the dirt. <sighs> it's a great machine. But, you know, it, it, it goes all the places my DR400, DRZ, DR400Z, goes all the places my DR400 used to go easily. Um, despite the fact it's 60 kilos heavier or something, so 50 kilos heavier. It's hot today, it's even hotter now. I might go home and, um, you know, run under the hose for a while. Cool down. <sighs> Good day. <laughs>